live here, guys. Very, very, very exciting. Um, we're going to be live here. First attacking round. Going to uh, XP3. Taking up that high road on this map, which is not very common, but I like seeing it immediately. However, is immediately spotted by that top defender who is protected by that cage there. And going to be coming up the left side here. Trying to get a pick here, maybe. Yep. Oh, not able to get that snapshot on Tailspin. Tailspin, you are gambling, my friend. XP3 is very dangerous on the offense. you got to be careful. And just like that, XP3 makes a jump, comes in there, gets the first hit. But great job there by Buds to get a hit, but is taken out in return. And Vince is going to have to clutch this defense, and he's not at the pole. This is going to be very dangerous for him to get to the pole and also has to get two hits. Coming out, and yes, immediate capture by XP3. ESP is up 1-0, to zero, and that is the first attacking round. First point goes to them. That is just nuts. So, ESP, Gills here. Oh, that's on defense. Why did it do that? All right. We got Tailspin on offense, who is a well-known uh, Tribes player in the North American community, if you're into Tribes at all, and has played a little bit of Firefall. So... Very uh, familiar with uh, first-person shooters, but takes an early hit there by Godson. Great defense right now by ESP. Tailspin going to have to be fighting uphill, as this will be a difficult attacking round. And the defense is rotating over. It looks like, yeah, we got two defenders now over on the left side, and Gil's still waiting. Going to be popping up, and oh, Tailspin eats another hit there by Godson. With only one armor left. Oh, that was his opportunity to get a hit, and unfortunately missed it. But great shot there on the Godson. Finally takes out his Bane and just misses picking off XP3. Gills down on the pole. Now the pole is live. He's got plenty of time. XP3 dropping down. They're going to be swarming. Great pick off on XP3. Is he going to be able to clutch this out? It's getting very close. He clutches it out and gets it 1-1. One one. An exciting start to this first map. I can't believe it. That was awesome. Man, Tailspin goes down to one armor and gets three hits. Oh, I'm so super excited for this semifinals here. Woo! I gotta calm down. I'm already getting too excited. This is round two. Let me calm down here. Gil's coming in on the offense. Gonna be rotating over to the right. And it looks like they know he's there as pre-fire is already coming out. And gonna be rotating over left. Trying to find someone out of position. Buds flirting with disaster there. Is able to get behind cover and comes out again. Oh, Tailspin though coming out. Gonna be putting in some pressure. And now they know exactly where Gil's is. And Buds again just playing it really close here comes a little bit of some rushing here by vincent gets a hit on the gills two armor now on gills he's going to be coming towards the pole has four seconds before it goes live now it's at one in another hit there by tailspin great defense here from px and i think they got some of those early round jitters out now and are looking very strong on the defense vince just uh narrowly avoids there. gills gets hit and px goes up two to one and here's their opportunity to get that offensive round that is going to offset this here. PX Vince on the offense. If anyone watching here knows what PX stands for, I would love to know. As I feel bad just calling them PX. And, it, and I actually don't even know what ESP stands for either. Um, unless it is actually like what actual ESP was at Extra Sensory Perception. Is that what their, their name is? I have no idea. But Vince here back in the action is coming over to the left but rotates back over trying to get that pick as someone will be rotating not able to get it vince looking for that left defender and just misses picking him off there xp3 still up top there and gets a hit early as vince was streaking in trying to get that hit he's going to take the left jump up and is he able to get an angle no but forces the defender down and now he has the high uh the high road but gets hit by uh who was it gills and xp3 back to back one in the back one in the front and is able to uh, take out their uh, Planet Express and ESP is named after the Cheats. There's Cheats ESP? I had no idea. Uh, thank you, Ethan, Wayne, and uh, Kraken for real. Appreciate the info. I hope you guys are enjoying the match so far. We are four rounds in, two to two. ESP and PX are looking very good. And again, those early game jitters look like they are out and are starting to play very crisp. Godson trying to streak in and get a hit there, unable to. And now a lot of pressure coming in from the defense. And Vince rotates up instead of falls back, but takes a hit there and loses his life for this defensive round. Trying to get another hit here onto Buds is Godson. And Buds just missing some of those shots, hitting the ground. Just had to aim a little bit higher. Unfortunate for him. And Godson just waiting for one of them to pick off and hopefully get a little antsy. 
Whoa, I bet he could feel the heat of that rocket as it came flying by. Not able to get a hit there, and nice shot there by Godson. Looks like he will be taking another offensive route for his team. 3-2 to two. ESP now looking like they are in prime position to take this first map here. That is Telescope. Uh, scoreboard here re real quick for you to let you see. And uh, Godson and XP3 with two points on defense. Tailspin has three points on defense. Very good there for the respective teams. Bud's playing it a little slow, trying to wait to get a player. Let's check out where the defense is set up. We have Gills and Godson uh, far in the back. XP3 up on top, which has been pretty standard here from this ESP team. And now Bud's really starting to push the pressure there. Not able to get that hit on the EX or XP3. Going to be coming out, trying to rotate over and pick someone off. Great hit there. XP3 will be sitting the rest of the round. But uh, Gills, in a very unusual place, is able to get two hits there onto Bud's. Bud's rotating back now, trying to pick off a player. Gets a great hit onto Gills. A very smart play. Not able to get that hit on the Godson. It's going to be one versus one. Wow, what a shot there around the, the fence there. We have two offensive rounds per team that they've taken, so just crazy. Um, or either way, yeah, you should be able to see the, the armors there. Uh, if, if you guys can't, let me know. I'll try to adjust things, but uh, you should be able to see it there. Uh, XP3 coming right up the middle, wanting to attack immediately. And going to be looking over to the left side. Tries to get a pick. Not happening. XP3 looking for that right jump. Most likely no. Waits for Vince, but unable to hit him. Comes up. Not able to get a hit there, too. And Vince, oh, Vince, you're just gambling here. Very scary. And comes out very fast and gets a great snapshot onto Vince. And so XP3 now looking like he wants to get another offensive point here. Really playing uh, with his head in just... Playing on his head, sorry, I was going to mix together a whole bunch of different phrases there, and then I realized I probably shouldn't say either of them, but Tailspin and Buds get, oh, Buds gets the third hit. I was going to say they get two hits and they clutch out that defense. Wow, very nice job there. I thought for sure that was going to be another attacking point. And let's see what Tailspin's able to do. He was able to get the first offensive point on, attack, on his first attack round. Gill's pushing way up on the right side, left defensive side, right offensive side. Going to be trying to swoop around him is my guess as he comes up. So that call up, whoa, great pickoff there by Godson, or on Godson by Tailspin. Tailspin probably assuming that the third defender is way in the back because he has been this whole time. So let's see if that's going to bite him in the butt. Very smartly playing, oh, playing slow, but is able to pick up XP3. Sees the other defender and Gills gets picked off in the head. And that looks like this is going to be a prime opportunity for PX to take the first map as it was looking kind of dire for them. After so many offensive rounds taken, there has been three, four, five offensive rounds. Great play here in the semifinals. This is just nuts. And Gil's now going to be trying to bring his team back into it. Well, they will be on defense if he can take this round, so it will be pretty easy. I say pretty easy, yeah. It's going to be somewhat easy to bring his team at five. And, whoa, Tailspin just getting completely picked off, was not aware of where the defender was. It's going to be up to Buds and Vince. Are they going to be able to clutch this out? Vince getting way out in the open, and so is Buds now. This is very interesting. Vince also right out in the open gets completely picked off. Buds is going to try to clutch this out. There's three armor left still on this player. Bud's unfortunately not able to get a hit. He needs an early hit here, but Gills just gets the kill and brings it four to five. If they get this, if they get this defensive point here, five to five will be forced into extra rounds. Vince going to try to clutch it out here, though, on offense. Very nice job by uh, Gills there to get his team an offensive point when it was very, very much needed. And again, setting up with his defense for someone to come swooping around. Pushed up real far, real far on the offensive right side, defensive left side. And good job not being spotted there. Let's see how he's going to end up responding. And I actually don't even see the third defender there, but Vince is going to be rotating back over towards the middle and checking everywhere for that third defender. Does not know where it is and almost gets picked off there where one armor and does and takes a second hit there by Godson. XP3 drops down, gets the third hit. It's 5-5 five to five on the first map which is very, very much expected here with such high caliber players. So looking really, really good here. Uh, very exciting to see this here. Godson, does Godson have an offensive round? He does. All of the ESP players have an offensive round. 
There's only one player in the game currently who doesn't, as Tailspin has two for his team, which is just crazy. And let's see here. Godson now coming over to the left. Is he going to be able to get an early pick here on one of the ESP players? No, he, but he gets hit and is down to two armors. So nice job by Tailspin. And another hit there by Tailspin. And a third. Wow, Tailspin has to have, yes, yeah, seven defensive points, two offensive. Tailspin is just playing on his head right now, looking very strong. And I think uh, both of these teams are smelling, uh, or yeah, smelling, what is what is that stuff that uh, they eat in France? The uh, escargot is what I was thinking. And uh, I think they're trying to get a little taste of escargot here and uh, really playing well. Buds, a very good rail here, going to be coming up way on the far right defense, or offensive side, and trying to get an early pick. He's way into the defensive zone here and completely baits XP3 from coming out there and gets a great shot there. He predicted that he would drop down. Great play. And Gill's in the back now. He knows where both defenders are. Excuse me. And is going to be now attacking that back defender and has to avoid the rocket fire here as he's starting to get swarmed. Not able to get hit on Gill's. Going to be coming up there onto that high catwalk and is going to be protected for a little bit. Not able to hit Gill's in the back. That was so close. Both defenders now look like they're kind of setting up down the, on the pole. Able to get one hit there. Godson not able to get a hit. And nice job by Budge. He gets the offensive point there to bring his team 7-5. to five. These are such, such exciting rounds. Extremely high pace. This is just so great to watch. Oh, man. That is just nuts. Uh, Dark Rabbi, thanks for tuning in, man. I appreciate you coming out here. Ethan Wayne, another very strong North American player. Appreciate you coming out here. Uh, excited to see you guys here. And what a great first round. Map score is 1-0. to zero. It, it should be live there on the overlay. So that was the first map. So uh, one to zero is the accurate, uh, the accurate. Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Map score. Jeez, you know when you start multitasking, my brain just goes crazy. I've actually worked at two jobs today, and so I am really tired. Maybe that's why I'm so energetic. Today. I'm, a, I'm a little, uh, I'm, I'm a little, uh, maybe out of it. Uh, a little tired. A little like that hyper tired. You know what I mean? Um, <laughs> so, so interesting. Um, Hey, Ethan Wayne, I would love to, man. Um, Dark Rabbi, any time that you would feel so generous as to let someone lowly as I cast with you, I would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And uh, any time, man, let me know. But Tailspin here on the offense did get two offensive points for his team. Going to be pushing up here on the left side. And surprisingly, nobody on the rail pad. So... Raz, what's going on, man, from Team Desire? Glad to see you out here. Carson, what's going on, guys? Hope everything is going well. Um, Tailspin, unfortunately, takes a hit there in the armor, and he's got one. But last time, he was down to one armor and completely clutched out his hits and ended up sniping out every player. Pole is live. Now, XP3 rotating over. That was his chance. Unfortunately, just missed. A lot of rocket fire coming out. Gets a great shot on the Godson. Going to be coming towards that pole now as only 7 seconds. Takes a hit. It's 1 versus 1. He's going to have to try to get a hit there. Just misses Gills. Is he going to be able to get the shot? Oh, just misses. Oh, oh, so close. Oh, so, so close. So, man, that was really, really close. And first point goes to ESP. Looking very, very good. And I uh, appreciate all the positive feedback, guys. You guys are all way too nice to me. Tailspin is on that rail pad, which we did not see from ESP. You see XP3 trying to get a pick off here. Is going to be pushing up the right side. He will be vulnerable right here. And just misses. Great dodge there by Tailspin. And gets the pick off on a Tailspin, which is a huge hit to this PX team. As Tailspin, I think, had nine points on defense last round and two offensive points. And Vince getting picked off there at that fence, which cuts the map in half. That is someone you want to have there. It gives so, so much vision. And XP3 wisely getting to very high ground. And Bud's going to be at a disadvantage. But XP3 drops down, is going to try to get a different angle here. So he doesn't expect to pick, jumps, picks up speed. Going to be jumping around. Great rotate there by Bud's. Gets a hit. And not able to get the second, but pushes back XP3. It's going to be very close. Is not able to get that pick. Hits him once. He's got to hit him one more time. Can't get him. And XP3 brings his team up 2-0. to zero. So, holy cow. This is so, so exciting. I thought for sure Buzz was going to clutch that out. And 
put a very good effort forward, but it's got to be kicking himself a little bit because he had his chance but just missed it. Vince, coming up this left, si left side for PX. Gills is far on that left side, kind of by spawn. XP3 at that middle. Oh, my goodness. Uh, great pick off there on the Godson. What a shot there by Vince. And now Vince is going to be pushing up that right side. And Gills now on the rail pad. Oh, almost picks off Vince. And XP3 trying to get hit, hit here. Vince looking like he's in very good position to get his team one of those defensive rounds that they need so very, very much. Gets a little bit of a high ground, drops back down. It's going to be rotating over by the pole. Oh, no, that was his chance. I don't know if his rail was off cooldown or not. Just narrowly avoids that rocket as it will be going live here in four seconds. Gills all the way on the back side. Vince wisely scooting back so he couldn't get that angle there as he funnels a little bit. Gets a shot there. Trey's one for one. Two armor and great shot around the corner. Vince gets his team the first offensive point. And let's see if PX is going to be able to get this defensive point and bring it two to two. This is getting so, so intense. Man, I was so excited for this. Oh, I hope you guys are watching it and enjoying this game because this is super exciting and has just been fantastic and non-stop action on these rounds. You get a lot of slow played rounds, but even even the slow played rounds have had tons of action. It's just been nuts. ESP Gills wisely looking for tailspin on that rail pad. He isn't there. It doesn't look like going to be rotating up to that middle fence. Bud still kind of back by the pole. Let's take a look here and see where the... Oh, I was going to say, let's see where the defenders are. But Gills is taking out tailspin way in the back there. Starting to put out some pre-fire. Tailspin is going to be on that left side. And jumping over, this is going to be a great opportunity. No, wisely stays behind the fence. And I'm not sure, oh yeah, on the pole already there, that is Buds. Buds has been playing pole defense for the most part for his team. Tailspin sticking out a little bit. You are brave, my man. But that is why you're in this top tier play, because you have balls of steel. And great job. Get, holy cow, triple tap by Buds to give his team that defensive round. I thought for sure it was going to be another offensive point. Very, very nice job. Gills unfortunately falls just a little bit short. Buds going to be on offense now. And going to be trying to give his team the lead here. Buzz rotating way to the left side, kind of in the middle. Gills is not on that rail pad and won't have an angle on him. Going to be rotating back. Not able to get that pick off on XP3. XP3 giving a little bit of some pre-fire just to kind of corral Buzz a little bit and slow his movement. But Buzz gets in and gets a hit there. Unfortunately, trades, but he is looking pretty good. I always want to go against two defenders. But, uh, you know, I don't know if trading is always worth it, but it doesn't matter. He doesn't trade right there with Godson. And now has two armor for one defense. For those of you competitive players out there, we got uh, new players like myself, and I'm sure we got some other people who are new to the game. Is it worth trading early? Oh, great hit by XP3. One armor versus one player. Cover yourself. Yes, nice job, Buds. Buds, you are flirting. Yes, XP3 is going to be trying to get the hit, and he gets it. Oh, no, Buds. I thought you had that round. Great clutch defensive play there. And even Bud says, nice one in the chat. Holy cow, I thought Bud's had that. Sorry, what I was trying to ask here is, do you want to trade early um, and, you know, get to two defenders? Does that make that big of a difference in, in an offensive round that you're only facing two defenders even though you have one less armor? I would love to hear some feedback on that, guys, so we could... Uh, educate new players and myself a little bit and unfortunately Vince doesn't get the opportunity to trade there as we were talking about that again but just gets picked off Godson now streaking over is going to try to pick off Buds here Buds wisely does not get hit and this is going to be a scary situation here as Godson has very good map position as Tailspin is a little bit away from the pole going to be dropping down not able to get that hit and now uh, Tailspin's getting very close and trades there Buds, is he going to be able to clutch this out again? He's been just a defensive master right now. Gets one hit, not able to get it, and great cap by Godson bringing his team 4-2. to two. Oh, man, ESP coming back with a vengeance. I believe this is best of five uh, now that we got to these final stages. Tailspin. Let's see, does Tailspin have an offensive point? No, Vince is the only one with an offensive point. XP3 and Godson for their team. Gills not using that uh, rail pad. XP3 going to be on that middle fence. And Godson on that right offensive side, left defensive side. Again, 
setting up as usual and not playing super, super aggressive, but Tailspin's going to go up, try to get a little bit of a higher vantage point. Knows where two of the defenders in, is, and now the third is Godson pokes out. Tailspin going to rotate back over. Not able to get that pick, but he's in a kind of precarious situation as they're starting to sandwich him a bit, but gets a great shot onto the ankle there of XP3, and now is going to have a little bit of a lead. Is he going to try to jump? Oh, no, eats a hit there, but great, 48.2 meter hit there in the back there on Gill is going to go towards the pole and gets a great cap for his team bringing it four to three hopefully if they get this defensive round they will bring it four to four so looking very good and Dark Rabbi yes this is an amazing NA series one of the closest we've seen a lot of them have unfortunately been not blowouts but it's been you know pretty handily won so yeah very exciting very good play here by North America makes me really really hopeful for the uh, ESW actually like final the cups you know not the qualifier and see if we can't bring it to Europe and let them know man we mean business we're coming here to play playa you know what I mean <laughs> sorry I'm, getting, I'm being silly man like I said I'm tired I've worked two jobs already today XP3 gets a great hit there onto Vince Vince unfortunately getting picked off quite a bit here Buds looks like he's gonna trade Tailspin you are brave my man way out in the open able to avoid that and going to be playing pull defense here, not usually his position, that's Buds, but going to be trying to get this here, and not able to get the attack, XP3 wisely, not just attacking it straight up, oh no, takes a hit there, Tailspin gets another, great job by Tailspin, great pull defense there, um, <laughs> B Toots is uh, making fun of me a bit, and I rightfully deserve that, so I'm not even mad at you. <laughs> So Vince going to be coming up here on offense. Is he going to be able to give his team the lead? Not able to get that hit there on the gills. Going to be rotating over to the right here towards Godson. Godson gets a great hit on to Vince, and Vince going to be fighting an uphill battle now. Not able to get that pick at middle fence. Going to be coming back over. No one on the rail pad for him. Luckily, not able to get that hit either. That was so close, and we're probably going to have a lot of pre-fire here. Um gonna be the only one with uh sorry i just i just read the chat and i just mixed it there man i gotta stop doing that so vince with two armor gonna be struggling here a little bit and oh no takes another two hits there from xp3 double tapped px has to clutch out this defense it's been very close esp doing a very very good job here on this offense here they have uh two offensive rounds but a bunch of them have been close so gills is the only one on his team that doesn't have an offensive round, unfortunately, for his team. Let's see what he's going to end up doing here. Trying to get an early pick is Tailspin. No, he's not on that rail pad. And so Gills knows he is going to have a little bit more mobility around that corner. Yeah, he just goes in there freely. And playing very passive here, um, which is wise. And oh, no, Vince again picked off really early in this defensive round. And just narrowly avoiding that one. Uh, Gills was and going to be rotating over and Buds kind of sticking out a bit. Good job there on the pole not to get hit. And <laughs> Vince says I must be the worst mid player ever. Whoa! But Buds and Tailspin simultaneously get hits bringing him to one armor and a great shot there by Tailspin. Bringing it 5-5. Five to five. We're in extra rounds or I'm sorry yes extra rounds on the second map here. This is Crossfire again. And look at that score there. Eight defensive points from Buds. He's doing just awesome there on that pole defense. So Buds playing it a little slow. And Gills looks like he is on that real pad, which they haven't done a little bit. And he's going to be seen there. No. Oh, Buds just misses that. That is not a shot Buds usually misses. Unfortunate for his team there. And then takes it in the ear there from XP3. And uh, trying to avoid this uh, pressure here. Good job getting that pick on the XP3. Another pick on the Godson Buds playing on his head right now. Is he going to be able to get this? Uh, yeah, come on. He's like, come on out, buddy. Come on out. Oh, yeah, I'm going to honk my horn at you, son. Honking my horn. And Gil's... Oh, no. Boost, I think he boosted himself on purpose. That was awesome. And gets another hit onto Buds. Oh, no. That was amazing if he meant to push himself off that wall. Oh, man. That was crazy. Oh. So that you can be the next... Uh, hey, I hey, I already sent... I, I'm not trying to put you on blast, Dark Rabbi. I'm not. But I told Dark Rabbi he is more than welcome to join. And when I mean that, I mean... 
could I be so blessed with the opportunity to join you casting this? So come on out here, Dark Rabbi. I, I will gladly, gladly, gladly uh, cast with you, man. I would love to. But Bud's almost getting picked off there. Vince is already taken out again. And unfortunate for this mid player here, Vince. And Bud's is taken out. And so, oh no, and Tailspin even saying, nice rocket jump, I'm stealing that. And um, Vince has got to be kicking himself a little bit. Tailspin trying to get this uh, great pull defense. Not able to get any hits there, and ESP takes map two in this best of five. It is one to one. Oh man, exciting, exciting play here. And uh, yeah, that rocket jump was awesome. That was so, so sick. So, um, man, hey, hey, guys, I, I understand Vince got picked off quite a bit there. He did take an offensive round, which is very difficult, but you're looking at some good players here in ESP. I mean, PX is, is great, too, but I'm just saying, you know, this, this is not exactly, you know, round one material. So, um, <laughs> I, I wouldn't play him too hard. And watch him come out here and, and clutch this map here as uh, as they are um, very high caliber teams. And so, Vince, hey, we all got bad maps, man. Bring it out. Come hard, son. Right? <laughs> or, or here, 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 since, since you guys loved that quote before. Come hard, playa. There we go. I, I, that was just for you guys. And whoa. Um, oh, they're switching sides here, it looks like. Okay. They're going to be switching sides. Um, wait, what are they doing? Maybe they're not? I don't know. Um, what? It, yeah, what in the world is going on here? They said they wanted to switch to get the different offense or defense here, and then said, K go right. Oh, they had the one player leave and then rejoin. So, got it. I'm dumb. Don't worry. Um, <laughs> B-toots, man. You are funny. I love you, man. You are funny, funny, funny. All right, XP3 coming out here on that first offensive round. Tons of pre-fire coming up the middle. Not able to get a hit. Tries to get a pick there, but it was unsuccessful. And I... Oh, sorry, guys. I didn't go to that map overview to give you the, the vision of where the defense is. Vince way up top. Buds kind of in the middle. No one really by the pole. Uh, unfortunately, Buds gets picked off in there in the middle. And Tailspin at the spawn. Um... Is it just me, or are they, like, really, really defensive? This is crazy. Tailspin rotating over. Gets a great hit there on the XP3. And almost gets another one. Narrowly avoids that shot there. And is going to be trying to get another hit there. And, whoa, XP3 just missing these shots. This is very uncharacteristic of XP3, especially on offense. Tailspin just missing that rocket. The pole is now live. He's going to have to be rotating over. And finally gets the hit there on the tailspin is Vince gonna be able to clutch this out for his team he needs to redeem himself and unfortunately not able to XP3 gets that offensive point I meant to check the um the snap delta time here guys let's see once once this goes live I'm sorry and then it's gonna get all the letters oh man it's sitting around a hundred that is really high uh, sorry about that but tailspin coming up on this right side avoids that pre fire you see gills on the right kind of by spawn XP3 in the same spot wow very similar defense here setups between the two and tailspin now going to be trying to get another pick off uh, or um, another pick i'm going to be trying to get a pick off kind of hanging out by the pole and really you know he can kind of hang out there for a while if he doesn't get hit and it's going to be crazy though because they will come swooping in xp3 narrowly avoids that tries to get that pick on a godson and really just slow playing this but the defense is just playing so so passive this is just crazy um and let's see, oh, Godson trying to drop down, gets picked off, Tailspin very wisely, not just going straight for the pole, unfortunately takes a hit there, though, by uh, XP3, takes out Gilzo, starting to cap it out, whoa, XP3 got one more hit there, very, very close, back-to-back -back offensive rounds here, starting off Green Valley, this is great, whew, looking very, very good, um... Yeah, Ethan Wayne, there was a huge discussion about the servers. Don't, don't even get us started on that. But Gil's coming over to the left, going to be on that hill with that box there. And um, a little bit of trash talking. Oh, never mind, that was Kaboomy. I didn't see Kaboomilly coming in there. Kaboomilly, uh, hopefully she'll be watching the stream there a little bit. And uh, if not, um, somebody let her know this is going on so she can at least see the match. Because I know Kaboomilly is pretty well known here in the North American scene. People like her. 
And uh, Tailspin getting a great hit there on the Gills from way back and by the spawn. Not able to get that top defender as Gills. And now they're coming down here with eight seconds left. Vince doesn't get picked off. That was very scary, but going to be coming forward. Not able to get that hit. He's rotating around. And a uh, great pick off there on the Buds. And another on the Vince. So Tailspin going to have to clutch this out. Great play by Gills. And Tailspin trying to play this pole defense. These, these pole setups are weird for me. And oh no, Tailspin gets hit. Three back-to-back -back hits. Uh, I'm sorry, points onto the offensive team. Two to one. Let's see if Buds will be able to get his team this offensive round in return. Um, I, I don't know what to say right now. I feel like th I'm, I'm just shocked that this is three back-to-back-to-back. -to -back -to -back. Um, man, I'm just I, I'm just a little shocked. I, I don't even know what to say. I feel like this is a really difficult map to attack on, but that just might be me. And I don't know if you guys got to watch any of the Euro teams play defense on here. They play aggressive, man. They barely let you in the, the archways. Buds, unfortunately, takes a hit really early. Going to try to get his pick on the gills. Not able to get it, but now puts himself in a pretty dangerous situation. Is able to trade, but you don't want to trade to give yourself one armor. And unfortunately, jumps into another hit. It's 3-1 to one here. PX has to take a round. They absolutely have to take a round if they want to... Uh, keep the pressure on here um, so let's see how this ends up going here Godson eats a real early rocket by tailspin nice job by tailspin hopefully gonna keep his team tight into here not able to get uh, that hit on that back defender I think it was buds it was buds Godson gonna be coming up here to attack tailspin it looks like no rotates over to buds gonna be coming around the wall not able to get the hit but takes a hit in the back by tailspin and then another hit, 3-2. to two. PX has to get an offensive round early. You do not want to wait for your absolute last round. That is just too much pressure. Let's see what Vince is able to do. Vince, the man who carries his team on his back, is coming in. Gills way on that right offensive side. Going to be putting out some rockets. And oh, no, Vince eats two early rockets. Only has one armor left. Oh, this has just not been the last, like, ten minutes for Vince, really unfortunate, not able to get that pick, Godson up there, still putting out tons of fire, and avoids it all, very nice job, Vince not able to get that pick off again on that back player, going to be rotating over to the left, trying to get an angle here, possibly on Gills, really trying to get that guy up top, I'm not really sure why, but eats a rocket by Godson, who is way up top, and Vince isn't able to get that point there, very unfortunate, 4-2, to two, XP3, a very dangerous offensive player here for ESP, going to be coming in, was able to get a point on his first round, Let's see what he ends up doing. He's going to be coming up that left side. I'm not sure what side he attacked last time, to be honest. So I can't really say, but is already at that hill with the box. I want to call that box the shack or something. I don't know. I'm going to call it the shack. Um, I'm coining it right now. Trademarked, injured, the shack. Whoa, double tap there by Vince. Vince is angry. Wants to start contributing here to his team. Doesn't get picked off. Almost gets the third hit there. And XP3 is in a very difficult situation. Only one armor. All three players up. 13 seconds left before the pole goes live. They will be swarming here very soon. But Tailspin says, nah, dog. I got this, man. We're done with this round. I'm ready to get me an offensive point. So let's see what Tailspin can do here. A very, very dangerous rail in every aspect. Uh, dangerous on that rail pad. Dangerous on the offense. Very scary player to play against. Let's see if he avoids the rocket fire. Wisely takes a second to go and doesn't get hit. He's going to be looking to get that pick off there on the right defender, but rotates over left just a little bit, or peaks left rather. Not able to get an angle here. Going to be coming up. I'm going to check to see where that defensive uh, locations are. Godson dropping down. Oh, that was your chance. Tailspin. Oh, just misses it and then eats a rocket by Godson. That was so, so close. Oh, man, I thought he had that. And a player actually inside the spawn. Tailspin not able to get it and eats another rocket. And is ESP going to be able to get to five? And great avoiding there by Tailspin. And Godson uh, almost getting picked off. XP3 gets picked off, though. Tailspin's got 14 seconds. getting swarmed like crazy. Gets hit by Godson again. And now they have to get this defensive round. And then Buds is going to have to get an offensive round. Oh, man. This is going to be clutch play from PX if they're going to want to stay in this. Um, Gills, I don't know if he, he does have an offensive point already. 
So let's see if he's going to be able to get a second to give his team the victory on this third map. It'd be the second map for them. Um, I just realized, I don't know if I updated the uh, scoreboard. I did. All right, updated it. So Gil's going to be uh, trying to get a pick off there on the top, not able to. And where are the defense? I'm going to switch to see the overview there. Tons of rockets coming out. Um, Buds is going to be at uh, Mini Shack. Tailspin is going to be at Spawn. And Vince there. Uh, Buds, wow, completely clutching out. Gets two hits. Great job by Buds. Sorry, guys, I didn't see that action as I was trying to see where the defenders were. Vince drops down. Oh, the pull is now live. He's only got one armor. Gills is trying to get a pick here as he's in a very dangerous situation. You never want to be attacking with one armor and three people so oh very scary situation um <laughs> uh the uber elite is gonna be uh taking a break here from playing for vince as it's not his offensive round totally joking here i'm gonna let this go and let buds uh focus here on offense Gills on that spawn side, XP3 kind of at mini shack, he's more behind the mountain, Godson up top there, UCLC, Buds, whoa, almost gets hit, they're going to sweep way over to the right, this defensive player should know he's there, but great pick on the XP3, Buds is what you got to do to get your team, narrowly avoids those rockets, this is very exciting, is he going to be able to tie it up for his team and send it into extra rounds, jumps over the spawn, can't get the hit, Gills was at his back turn, not able to get it, but gets a pick on the Godson, Buds, can you clutch this off for your team, you still have 7 seconds man, Play it slow. This is a very open um, um, pad for you to get. And Gil's coming in now. He starts to cap it. And he gets the cap, bringing it 5-5. Five to five. Great, great, great play by Buds. Buds just thriving on that pressure. Whew. Great job. We are in extra rounds now. Godson going to be on attack. You see the defense again setting up very similarly. Buds going to be rotating over to Minishack. Tailspin. To the spawn. Oh, man, this is crazy, crazy stuff, guys. This is so, so great. Again, if you guys are just joining uh, and you're on Twitter, please retweet me, at Andrew13. Let people know this match is going on. Unfortunately, Buds gets picked off there. Excuse me, I had the hiccups and I was trying to hold it back. But are they going to be able to clutch this out? Vince is very close to getting picked off there by Goss and drops down, actually. And... Oh, man, Tailspin narrowly avoiding that shot. Not able to get a hit. Actually, trades there. Vince, clutch this out, man. This is your opportunity. Bring it back. Bring it back. Can't get it, unfortunately. And an immediate offensive point here by Godson. Vince, here's your opportunity again. Five defensive points. Very good job on defense. Can he get his team an offensive point? Oh, man, Vince. Let's see what you're doing, man. Rotates up the middle. Going to be going straight up the middle. And not able to get that pick on that top player. And has been trying to get that quite a bit here. But is not able to. So, Vince now coming up this uh, side here. Going to be exchanging with XP3 very soon. And, oh, no. Does not get the hit. And takes two. Third hit there. Third map goes to ESP. ESP is now up 2-1. to one in this first to three series so man uh... what is px stand for again planet extreme planet explode uh... planet planet something Pla something about planets i know that but uh... planet express yeah <laughs> thanks completely forgot all right swift looks like it's gonna be coming um, Let's see here. They're not really sure who should be picking it. Uh, let's see here. Are they going to be playing Swift? Um, man, it seems like we just never know. Um, yeah, we are going to be going to Swift. This is not one of my favorite maps. So, um, you know, not a big deal. But, um, again, uh, appreciate the support here, guys. Again, tweet this out. Retweet for me. And uh, let's let people know what's going on here as this is, this could be the last map here of the semifinals. I'm going to give you guys a link to the brackets here again if you guys want to check out the brackets. And um, let's see here. Oh, <laughs> who did you just call Team Hopper? Oh, man, that, that that's rough. Um, 
let's see here. We got um, AMZ and B2G should be playing today. If anybody has eyes on that, can they please give me a score update? I would really, really love to know how that's going. Um, and the loser of this will drop down into the loser's semifinals. So... Um, winners obviously move on to the winners finals so we'll see what ends up happening there but um, should be going live here soon I'm like so parched I like I I'm so so thirsty it's crazy right now <laughs> um, man and we got we, we still got more rounds here of shoot many to bring though so oh night nimbus what's good man night nimbus good to see you brother Hope to be bringing some NASC action here soon, so we can't get back at it, man. Um, the roster, roster. Oh, you we probably were talking about DNJ. Um, yeah, Buds did did a little bit, but you know, I think he was just trying to do his thing, man. You know, I don't think he was hating on anybody or anything, just trying to to find his niche. But Tailspin gonna be on offense here for his team first. Is he going to be able to get an early point here as ESP did take that map on offense first, which is uh, scary. Tailspin kind of getting to the high ground here, going to be rotating up to that half donut and almost gets that pick there onto Godson. Godson kind of sticking out, XP3 sticking out here a little bit now. Is he going to be able to get this early pick waiting for someone to, whoa, I thought that was going to be a hit there. Godson trying to, starting to flirt a little bit here and let's see what ends up happening oh no not able to get a hit he's kind of slow playing this a bit which I understand drops down whoa that was very dangerous he up hit takes a hit there takes a second hit not able to get a pick with that shot but Gill's dropping down now and this is going to be very difficult hill to climb but gets a shot on the XP3 playing very well right now and gets a hit on the Godson four seconds before goes and <laughs> gets the hit on the Gills holy cow Tailspin again going immediately to one armor and ends up getting the offensive round. That is crazy. Whoo, man, that was awesome. Man, Tailspin. I, I I really liked watching Tailspin in Tribes, but I gotta say I really like watching watching him in uh, in Shoot Mania too, man. This is super super exciting. ESP Godson now on the attack, trying to get a hit there, and great shot by Vince. I think he was on the rail, and a second hit by Vince. And unfortunately, Vince is taken out, but Bud swarms in, and PX immediately goes up 2-0. to zero. So, wow, great job by PX coming out really strong. They really want to bring this to a map 5, which is completely deserving of, you know, this semifinals here. So... Again, NH, oh, Buds gets an immediate pick and sees Gills there up on the rail peg. Going to try to get an angle here. Trying to bait out the shot. Does not able to get the hit on Gills, but Buds is still in the lead here. And looking very good and not able to trade there. Takes a hit and a second hit and almost a third. Gills doing very good on that rail pad and Buds is just so brave there. And finally gets the hit. One armor versus one defender, Godson. Oh, no, he's going to rotate over to that half donut, jump up on top, try to get Godson when he's rotating all out of the crazy areas here. Not able to find where the defender is. Drops down, not able to get that hit, but going to start capping it. And, whoa, narrowly avoids that rocket. Not able to get that hit. Going to be rotating. Oh, good job getting that defense there from the fence. Not able to get that pick there. Going to be coming in. No, not able to get that hit. Avoids the rocket. Only three seconds left. He already, he does have some time in it, but no. Ooh, Godson's able to get the hit. I think Bud should have just stayed on the pole, but you know what they say. Hindsight is 2020. So, good job there. Um, good job there by uh, ESP. I believe that was Godson on defense. Again, man, my memory is just so short as I'm reading chat and everything else. But, uh, oh, man. All right, Gills coming here on the offense. A lot of fire coming out. And Gills not able to get an early pick here. And Vince almost gets picked off. Great reaction there. Knows where Gills is now, too. So let's see if they end up start swarming. Vince not able to get a shot there onto him, but doesn't uh, trade, which is good for right now. And actually decides to drop down to give himself a little bit more mobility, which is completely understandable. Using that fence to get up. Might be dropping on the rail pad himself, but takes a hit there by Vince. Oh, tailspin, your head was just barely poking out, man. You got to hit that control button to crouch. That's a joke since you can do that in like every other game. And nice hit there by Vince. 
bringing Gills to one armor. Not able to get that pick there onto Buds. Going to be trying a different angle here. Not able to get it. Four seconds left on the pole. You might as well just hide now. It doesn't matter. Buds gets the hit. Great job. And uh, able to really do a good job there. Vince, how many points does Vince have right now? Four defensive points. So to all you haters out there, Vince is finally into his groove. Great job. And let's see if he's going to be able to make the offense work here. Not able to get that early pick on the XP3. Goes for it. Not able to get that hit. And waiting to see the rail pit. It doesn't look like there was a player. They're going to be rotating over to the tunnel maybe. And tries to get that hit there on that player but not able to. Going to rotate maybe to the back or is he going to go up the middle? Rotates back towards the middle towards those arch. Kind of where that half donut is. And is going to try to get a pick here. And I think he was noticed. Yep, ping's got to be coming out as all the players are adjusting very well. XP3 on that very low kind of L fence. And great shot onto Gills. Starting to get swarmed here by XP3, but gets hit. He's high in the air. And is he going to eat one? Oh, good job avoiding it. It's two versus two. Not able to get that hit on the Godson. Godson gets a hit, and XP3 gets another. Vince almost able to clutch out that offense. And, um, yeah, so I am definitely using uh, Night Nimbus's overlay. Night Nimbus, I'm sorry, man. I haven't got my own. I love you very much for letting me use this so far. You are a great dude. I promise you I will get my own here in the near future. All right, XP3 coming up here on the left. Um, trying to get a pick here, but it doesn't look like there is anyone up on there. Going to jump over to the half donut. Jumping up to get the high ground. Vince is kind of out in the middle. A lot of rocket fire coming out, and Vince gets another early hit. But Tailspin is picked off, which is a very strong player here for Team Planet Express. And XP3 just narrowly avoids Vince there. One shot coming out and almost baits Vince out. But Vince wisely avoids it and hits the tree as he tried to get that angle there onto Buds, who's been an outstanding pole defense player here for his team. XP3 getting trapped there. Gets a hit onto Vince. Buds now the lone defender. He comes swooping in. And oh, no, he got the hit but couldn't get the second. Oh, man. And so 3-3, three to three, we finally get an offensive point there. XP3 gets it for his team. Tailspin going to be trying to get his team another offensive point. Let's see where the defense actually sets up. XP3 putting out a lot of fire. It doesn't look like anyone's going to be going up to that rail pad. So Tailspin's going to have a free ride here to the donut if he wants to go up on the donut. Gills way in the back up on that wall. Tailspin jumps out. He does look like he's rotating over to the donut, or half donut rather. A lot of fire coming out from XP3. Narrowly avoids that rocket fire. Tries to get a hit there on XP3. Not able to get it. And going to be coming out now, rotating over. Going to be going for a jump shot most likely and gets it onto XP3. Great job. Three armor still narrowly avoids that rocket. Very, very close. And Tailspin now going to be duking it out with the two remaining defenders. Godson almost getting picked off, but is able to stay alive. Godson now rotating back over towards the pole and not able to get that hit. But Tailspin eats three quick hits from Godson. Oh, no. That was really unfortunate for Tailspin as he was in the lead. So, unfortunate play there for Tailspin. ESP's got to be pretty happy. But as of right now, we don't have anyone in the... Uh, Let's say in the lead, quote unquote, as defensive rounds trading out will keep it even. Godson underneath that half, uh, um, that half donut takes a hit there by Vince. Vince doing amazing work on this rail pad, has really, really been playing well. Narrowly misses that one as you saw it hit the wall next to Godson. Godson rotating over to the tunnel, going to be cutting through right now. No, decides to go to the back and is going to be rotating on that jump up. I don't know if I want to go up this. I'm not lying. Going to be rotating all the way over to this hole in the wall. Is Vince there? No, he's not. But a lot of rocket fire coming out as they had a good idea. Bud's unfortunately picked out as he is one of the... Oh! Doesn't matter. Tailspin and Vince simultaneously hit him, bringing him to zero armor. Four to four on this fourth map. ESP has two maps under their belt while Planet Express has one. Bud's going to be on the offense here. And let's see what Buzz is going to do here for offense. It's going to be very interesting. Looks like he's rotating all the way to the back. And so not able to get a pick. And as I say that, Godson taken out on that rail pad. And Buzz is going to rotate now back over towards the middle. Rotating his angle of attack. Trying to get a pick. Gills way out in the open but was able to see him rotating. 
and so drops down, but is going to be at an interesting uh, angle, but takes the uh, jump pad up. Couldn't think of what it was called there. And is going to be coming through the window, maybe? No, he's still up top, drops down finally inside the box there. <clears throat> Three seconds before the pull goes live, he's still got all three armor, avoiding a lot of fire. Gills and XP3 trying to get a hit here. Buds recharging, is able to avoid the rockets, gonna be coming out, gets a hit, trades, but there is only one defender, just narrowly misses that onto XP3, attacks the pull, and is not able to get it. He times out! Oh no, that was his opportunity, Buds. He's been playing so well on offense, but just has not been able to finish. Oh, man, that is really, really unfortunate. <clears throat> Gills now on the offense. Going to be able to force his team into the winner's final. Are they going to be able to get it in? Not able to get the hit there, but will be trying to get a pick off here as he gets Vince. Oh, no. ESP is in the lead here now. There's still two defenders, Tailspin and Buds. Very, very strong defensive players. And is he going to be able to get a pick? No, not yet, but there's still a ton of time here. Ten seconds left. And going to be trying to get this angle here on the Tailspin. Tailspin trying to bait out that hit. But um, is he going to be able to get this shot onto the arm? Oh, it looked like he had it. So, unfortunately, Tailspin gets picked off right on the immediate recharge. Buds has been in this position over and over all night. Gets one hit already. Very good job. Is he going to be able to clutch it out? Is not able to get a hit there and gets the double tap. Nice job, PX Buds. Whew. Going to extra rounds here on map four, guys. Again, I appreciate everybody coming out here and watching this. This has been so, so fun. I love the support here from the North American Shoot Mania scene. People are saying North America sucks at this game, and I want to prove them otherwise, guys. Good luck to these teams as they are in extra rounds. Vince not able to see anybody, but gets a great pick on XP3, who is one of the strongest players here on ESP and just always plays really well. Vince jumping up to this half donut and narrowly avoids those rocket fires. Not able to hit Godson. Godson just barely escapes with his life. Not able to get a hit on the gills and almost gets pushed into the electric water of doom. Godson is going to be out there. No, tries to get that pick off in. Great job using that launch pad to avoid that rocket fire by Godson. And let's see, not able to get the pick though. It's going to go live in one second. And gets a pick there. Trades has a little bit of time already on the pole. Not a lot though. And is going to have to try to get it here. Vince, is he going to be able to clutch it out? He gets the hit. Vince gets the hit and gets this offensive, his first offensive point of the series. Bringing it 6-5, to five. XP3, one of the most dangerous offensive players here, probably the most dangerous offensive player here for ESP, going to be on offense. Is he going to be able to clutch it out, bringing it to 6-6? Six to six. Vince just playing on his head here uh, on uh, Swift here, looking very, very good. AX, or I'm sorry, I keep trying to call him EXP. XP3 looked like he was checking the tunnel, but it's going to rotate over. Very, very defensive setup here from... Um, PX and XP3 now going to be streaking out is not able to get an angle on anybody and I he could get this hit there and great job by Vince getting an early rocket hit it narrowly misses that one but Vince is picked off so Vince was able to trade before he was taken out Tailspin and Bud's going to be the lone defenders uh, for their team are they going to be able to get another hit here the pole goes live right now XP3 is going to try to get his attacks going to go right onto the pole and a double tap to give them the map we are going to map five here, guys. Two maps to two. Absolutely B-A-N-A-N-A-S. What does that spell, ladies and gentlemen? That spells bananas. Look at Vince there. Eight defensive points. Buds with seven. Tailspin, not the threat. He has been in the past maps, but always a very, very dangerous player. But he was absolutely a factor getting his team to this map five. So... Vince, as Ram Bisley has said, has come to play, playa. Let's see here. I don't think we're playing Paladin. Are we playing Paladin? I thought we... I did not realize this was one of the maps. Okay. We are playing Paladin. And uh, it will be very interesting to see how this pans out here. Um, I think they're trying to get the teams on the right offense or defensive side here. We got some downtime. Again, guys, love the support. If you're on Twitter, follow me at Injured13. Also, retweet it out, guys, that this is the last round here. 
And if anyone has any info on that B2G um, slash uh, AMZ game, please, please, please let me know. I'm going to real quick link a Reddit post to this, guys. Please give me feedback and let me know how to improve on my casting. I want to give you guys the best experience. Even something as little as uh, make the cursor more, uh, more solid. Could you use the default cursor? Could you use a different... Um, cursor so that way they can see it better anything that really you know lets you the viewer see what's going on um, if it's anything I'm commentating I would love to know guys I want to give you guys the absolute best experience you can as this game is just so fun to watch so back to the action as I'm done talking tailspin I think on that rail pad gets an early hit onto XB3 who is oh so very dangerous can be coming out here with speed and just nearly uh, miss each other and tailspin oh gets picked off but from the grave gets a hit Vince almost getting picked off there wisely cuts back unfortunately Buds gets picked off Vince is gonna try and clutch this out for his team and oh I thought he was picked off but Buds gets the hit first defensive round goes to Planet Express here guys crazy crazy craziness great job but um, let's see tailspin is gonna be here on offense I was trying to think of the tailspin song woo do 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 everywhere that we go I see duck tails woo I don't know if any of you are old enough to remember that I know tailspin is but uh, avoids that rocket fire gonna be coming up in very very defensive setups here from these teams which really just speaks volumes of the pressure of these matches skills on that rail pad Tailspin, is he going to rotate? No, he's going to go through McDonald's arch right, cuts back, tries to get that rail pad defender out of position, not able to get it. Going to be coming in here and able to trade there. I don't know if that's what he wants. Narrowly avoids that hit there, or that rocket rather, and is going to be coming towards the, the pole a little bit. Going to try to get a hit, takes the, the lift. I don't know if he meant to. Gets the hit on the Godson, and is he going to be able to get this hit? Um, going to probably attack the pole here any second. Gills trying to get a hit, but Tailspin gets it. Goes up 2-0 to zero on ESP. Great play by PX. That is just awesome, awesome, awesome. <laughs> uh, Nutri Gains, I, I'm sorry, man. Uh, I, I really thought y'all would appreciate that uh, Tailspin singing, but uh, maybe not. I, I completely understand. But Gills now on the offense, narrowly avoids that rocket and lift, tries to use the bounce up. Vince just avoids that shot there. Gills kind of hanging out for a little bit, falls back into the spawn there for the defense, not able to get up there. It looks like he's going to be going for this jump, not able to make it again. And there's still 20 seconds left, so not uh, a ton of time taking. Great pickoff on a tailspin. And tailspin, again, that's really tough that he's taken out so early in a round. Gills now going to be rotating up, trying to get that pick on the Buds. Buds is going to be very careful. Nice job by Vince getting that hit in the shoulder. And unfortunately gets picked off. <clears throat> is Buds going to be able to clutch this out? Ten seconds left as the pole's alive. Trying to get a hit there. Not able to. Is he going to take this lift? It looks like yes, he is. Not able to get the hit as he goes up. Buds gets a double tap on either side of the pole. Very good play. I'm going to check IRC here real quick, guys. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Um, I don't see it. And, uh, oh, I did get a response, but, um, cool, no problem. And so, can't add in, a, oh, <laughs> yeah, they said, uh, have fun. He said, can't add in a good luck. I love the friendly banter. So, let's see what PX is going to be able, PX Buds, rather, is going to be able to do. Not able to get that pick off, and not able to hit Gods in there either. Gods in now rotating over, playing very aggressive, and holy cow, just an uh, absolute swarm fest. Buds, though, able to trade, looking pretty good still so far. Tries to jump up over, is able to get the jump up, coming over now towards the pole. I don't know if he saw Gots in there or not. He saw Gills, Gills on that rail pad, and personally, I wouldn't want to duke it out, but Bud said, nah, man, no, no problem, man. I got this, man. And knows where the final defender is, and gets another offensive point. Four straight rounds for Planet Express. This is looking very, very dire for ESP. And I don't know what they're going to do to come back from this. Absolute madness. So let's see what Godson's going to be able to do. Is he going to be able to take a round here for his team? Man, PX, four straight rounds and they're on defense. That does not bode well for ESP currently in this fifth map. Let's see. I'm going to switch over to the defensive setup here, guys, to the overview. 
and uh, give you a little bit better vision. Actually, I lied. Oh, tailspin from the rail pad, and Vince immediately one armor, but gets a pick off there. Buds able to stay alive. We know where all the defenders in, so now defenders are, so we don't have to worry about it too much. But great job there by this defense. Whoa! Tailspin picked off. Is Buzz going to be able to clutch it out as he has been just amazing on this pole defense? You know, Buds has just really, really been playing well. It's just absolutely amazing. Strafes out, gets the hit. Holy cow. Such confidence there. That is amazing. Let's see if Vince can make it six straight, guys. Look at that. Three defensive points, three defensive points, three defensive points, one attack, one attack. Can we make it one attack here, Vince? I think it's providential, man. This is absolutely being set up for you. I hope you're able to get this for your team, Vince. ESP, good luck to you guys in this final round. It's going to be very difficult to overcome five points, but it is possible as PX has done five straight and narrowly avoids that rocket fire there. That was very close. And here comes our first attack to the stairs. And not able to get that pick off. Very close. And gets a great shot. I think he was just shooting. There's no way he could have seen Godson. Either way, amazing play there by Vince. Vince trying to make that jump up. Not able to. And not able to get that pick off there under that defender. Pole is about to go live here. It is live. Going through the right arch of McDonald's. XP3 is able to trade Gills. Able to clutch out and give their team the first point. However, Planet Express is on match point for like the next four rounds. And they're on defense. So they have, I think, what, two defensive rounds to get the point. XP3, very, very dangerous here on offense. Going to try to keep his team in this. And you see Vince and Buds in their usual setup. And again, Tailspin is going to be on that rail pad. I, I'm not going to lie, I'm a little shocked. I thought they would play a little more defensive. But Tailspin going to try to get an early pick here. And not able to get an angle quite yet. And might be rotating back over, I don't know. XP3 coming very fast. Tailspin not able to get the hit. But XP3 putting in a lot of pressure. I'm going to be rotating over Buds trying to get in some rocket fire. And Tailspin gets an early hit and starts immediately rushing XP3 down. Gets a second hit. There's going to be the swarm here very soon. Tailspin clutches it out for his team. And Planet Express will be moving on to the winner's finals. Congratulations, PX Planet Express.